Well, let's start tying them. I got a size 12 hook in the vise. Start with making a thread base all over the hook like this. So, and I find this foam cylinder and I find this right length and I use this razor blade I'm gonna cut a little slice in this foam cylinder be sure not to cut my fingers I think I made a little notch there just get this magnet of my table so just use the scissor and just snip off this and uh, I'm gonna use some some lacquer I could use some super glue but maybe I should do that it's a bit bit, bit bulky I don't want it to go running down into my bobbin. The final notch that I've been making it's not easy because it's there, it's there. So I think I got it like this and use some wrappings on the base of this so I think that's not very nice and uh, it's a bit long but uh, that's gonna fix it and now I found a black hackle from a saddle I had and just attach this to this open space here just wind it around in spirals like this and uh, tight off with your tread voila I cut off some hackle fibers but doesn't matter use touch your tread in the front and make a whip finish and this fly is almost done so what I'm gonna do now I just have to cut off some of this it's not gonna be so long just round it up a little bit maybe also just use your flame turn this another way in the vise so I can reach the back end you can shape foam with this flame if you are careful so turn this the right way There you have it guys, the simplest ant you can ever tie. This is how it's gonna, gonna look when, uh, when you're ready. Very nice little uh, simple ant pattern, very nice and um, that's all I had for you today. So thank you all for watching my videos 
and uh, bye bye and tight lines please share and subscribe